is a my first test of this year in anatomy. I need to study. All my studying stuff is over there. And I am over here. Procrastinating. I'll get to it soon. I'm gonna go get a shake first and then I'll get to it. Hi, can I please have a an Oreo shake with whipped cream please? Oreo shake? Yes. I'm the happiest girl in the world right now. Mm hmm. Mm. Have my shake. Now I'm gonna study a little bit. I'm just gonna review some of the PowerPoints and I'm gonna do some practice quizzes. So, for practice quizzes, I will show you quickly what I've been doing. This is the one I was working on before I went and I got my shake. So, the lymph from the upper right quadrant of the body typically passes into the venous blood via what? Hmm, I know this one. It's not the left lymphatic duct because that does not exist. It's not the thoracic duct because that's everything else that's not in this question over here. So I'm going to say the right lymphatic duct. And I got it right. I'm going to continue studying and practicing and after this I will probably go to bed and I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. I have water all over me. That's okay. I opened my water bottle, couldn't handle myself and drink as much as I could. Three classes today. Histology first, which is um, in other words the study of cells. Then I have biochemistry. Oh no, I have three I have four classes today, what am I talking about? I have histology, then biochemistry, and then I have anatomy lecture, and that is the last lecture that will be covered on the exam. So he uploaded the video before the weekend so we could see it, I did watch it, so I'm looking forward to today's lecture to make sure that I reviewed it well. And then we have intro to podiatry, which is just a class that we have um, different podiatrists come and speak to us about what they did with their career and our options basically so that class ends at 250 after that I plan on um, staying in the library and studying for a long time because my exam for anatomy is tomorrow morning so I will catch you guys sometime later Bye. so I'm walking to my car kind of sweaty but I spent a lot of time walking around the library to try to see if I could find a chair. I couldn't. It's pretty packed. I guess a lot of people have exams around this time. So I'm going to go home. Hopefully I don't get too distracted. And I will talk to you there. I've been studying for a little while now. And I probably will be studying for the rest of the night. I'm going to try to go to sleep early right now. It's 6.56 p.m. I don't want to go to sleep too late because I don't want to be exhausted from my exam. But unlike my Instagram picture where you see everything so nice and neat, here's my mask. It's reality. So, anatomy exam tomorrow. I'm going to study hard. I'm still going to try to review um, quickly my stats because I have a quiz Wednesday. I have a quiz on Thursday as well. I have a quiz on Thursday as well for histology, so I probably won't review for that until tomorrow. Because my anatomy test is a two-part test. We have a lecture exam, which we take in the lecture room, and then we have a practical, meaning that we get to go into the lab. The professor puts pins on different um, sections of the body and can ask either like ID questions, meaning what is this a secondary question, like what innervates this, meaning like a nerve or something like that. So right now I'm really just focusing on the slides and things like that and practice questions. I'm gonna keep studying. I think I'll be done vlogging for today, just so I can focus and I will see you guys tomorrow. 
Good morning. Today is Tuesday. My lens is getting foggy because it was raining all morning. Um, it's exam day. I'm going to try to get to school. I will probably study during the classes that I do have before my exam and I will talk to you guys later. I'm done with my first part of the exam. It's not done yet. Nope, I still have a practical. Yep, still got a whole second half to go. Whole second half to go. Whole second half to go. Are you gonna let me go or not? Okay, thank you, boy. Anyways. I finished my first part of the anatomy exam, which was the lecture exam. We had 57 questions. I feel like he was very fair and straightforward. But then again, who knows? I usually feel that way when I'm well prepared. I've seen both instances where I'm not prepared and I am prepared for an exam, so I know the difference. But sometimes you feel like, hey, I got that down. See your score and it's like a 50 something. Um, we'll see. I won't jinx myself. Um, I'm gonna study the rest of the day for two things tomorrow. I have a stats quiz in the morning and then I have my practical, my anatomy practical. I'm gonna be practicing a lot of IDing today with some quizzes online of cadaver images and as well as like diagrams that you fill in because you get graded on spelling. So I need to practice all of that. I just got home, it's kind of, what time is it? So now it's six. I stopped and I did my nails because I just felt like doing it. So now I'm gonna study. I'm having a bowl of cereal because I'm starving. Cheerios, chip chip, hooray! <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get started. I have a quiz tomorrow, stats quiz, and I have an anatomy exam. And then I have a quiz on Thursday. Yesterday I was supposed to do a HIIT workout. I do them Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And I tried to go to the gym on Saturdays and Sundays if possible. I didn't do it yesterday because I got really tied up with anatomy. So I'm gonna do that today. It's only a 15 minute workout. It's been really nice. It gives me a good sweat, nice heart pounding workout. So I'm gonna move this. I'm gonna cross this off because I did not do it and put it down here. And then I have to do it tomorrow again. And then I have to do it on Friday. Also, we have a big little social on Thursday that I'm really excited to record and show you guys. We have upperclassmen who pair up with the first class, first year's class, as like a big little, um, little thing, little scenario thing. And um, I'm excited for that. So you'll see that on Thursday. Right now I'm gonna study for my quiz and my exam. And I think I'm done vlogging for today. I might show you guys a little bit of my workout. I'll do that. Okay, bye. Bye. Hi. So I just got home. I stopped very quickly to get some food because I'm starving. But I just wanted to say that I was thinking about it like on my drive and I just feel, I just feel so lucky to be a part of the class that I'm in. Like everyone is so supportive of each other and so like, we're like a good team, like a good unit. If you guys are watching, shout out to you guys. But yeah, 
we made it through our first anatomy exam, practical and lecture. So he might be posting those grades tonight and I'll be waiting for that. Right now I'm gonna eat, chill a little bit, then I'm gonna start studying for my histology quiz tomorrow morning. Um, I hate histo. Hey, histology! I'm just kidding. And I have a pimple. I think it's because of everything, but... Stats was good, too. I had a stats quiz. I feel like I'm repeating myself with every clip that I make, but... I'll edit that stuff out. Um, so I'm gonna wait and see till I get my stats grade as well. We'll see how both those things went. I'll show you my food so you can see what I got. It's really good. I love Pollo Tropical. That's the place. It's like a... It's like Hispanic food, but it's like... Fast food. Yeah, I'll show you. I'll show you what I got. Let me see. Yum, yum, yum. It's rice, white rice, half. So you can pick a base. I always pick a half rice, half lettuce. And I get tomatoes. That's the half lettuce. Tomatoes, corn, black beans. I don't know if you can see it. Oops. Chicken. Homemade dressing which is some oil and white vinegar. Yummy, yum. Oh, if it chooses to come out. Oops, that was a lot. That's okay. All right, I'm gonna eat Chuck yeah later. And just like that, I finished. Yeah, I was hungry. Now, I guess I'm gonna study. But before I study, I'm going to probably do hit max to get it out of the way because I have to do it. Yeah, today's Wednesday. So I'm going to do that first. Take a shower. Chill. Then I'll study. Then I'll study. Because I have a quiz tomorrow. So then tomorrow after this quiz for histology, tomorrow I'll show you guys how I prepare my study schedule for an exam because I plan on starting to study for my biochem exam on Monday tomorrow because I'll give me one two three four yeah four days that's good hopefully so I'll show you guys that tomorrow and tomorrow I only have oh wow tomorrow's gonna be a good day I have three lectures in the morning and then I have the big little social so I'll show you guys some of that too. You'll get to meet some upperclassmen. Maybe I'll get a few of them to talk for you guys. We'll see, but I'll check in with you guys later. I'm done with him, Max. drop in so I'm just kidding um so I showered and now it's 8 43 and I'm going to continue with my studies probably gonna go to sleep at um, hard to tell right now but I'm gonna study for the rest of the night tomorrow I only have three classes three three classes and then we have the big little social that will be fun. So I'll vlog tomorrow. Have a good night. Toodles. Curly hair and humidity do not mix very well. But what can you do? Um, it is 7.41 right now. I left early. I'm leaving early because I have my histo quiz today. They just opened the Dunkin' Donuts in front of my house. Maybe that's a good thing. Maybe that's a bad thing. I really miss getting vanilla chais. And I just haven't while I've been here. But today's the day. Reticulum and the Golgi membranes. A cell has a number of smaller organelles. You guys know how excited I was for that vanilla chai, right? This is what I get. 
water is fine, I guess. They are opening in another hour. I'm not waiting another hour, so no vanilla chai for me today. <clears throat> Maybe later. But I'll check in with you guys later. So have a great day. I'll have a great one. Even though I didn't get my vanilla chai, I'll get a cafe con leche that they sell right next to my class. I usually get it. It's so good. Oh, so good. So I'm home now. I was laying in bed when I got the notification that the exam grades were up and I did so well. Like I'm so happy right now. But I worked so hard and I like I Oh my god. I still don't know about the practical, but the lecture, oof. I did so well. I did so well. Because I had great study partners. I had great discipline studying for this exam. I worked very hard and my score shows it. So I'm very happy with the score. I have an exam on Monday. Now I just feel so like motivated to keep this trend going. All right. I'm going to study now. This is oh. <laughs> I'm going out. I'm going to the big little social. <laughs> Our school um, has lecture capture, meaning that we can go back and rewatch the lectures. So I split up the lecture captures for the seven lectures for today, tomorrow, and Saturday so that on Sunday I could just review everything that I had reviewed with the lectures captures so today I already did that for the two lectures that I had set out today so I'll show you um, I had protein structure and protein function and then I have for tomorrow enzymes and coenzymes enzymes kinetics and allosteric enzymes I put three for tomorrow because tomorrow I have more free time and then on Saturday I have two left so then I have YouTube video. Hey, I'll upload on Sunday. Right now I'm running a little late. It's 7.18. And I'm supposed to be there at 7.30. So I'll catch you guys over there. Toodles. Today's Friday. I'm so excited. I'm just kidding. Today's Friday. All I have today is a lab at 1. And it's 11.53. I got up. Well, first, I slept in. Felt so good. Felt so nice. But I slept in um, till about 9-ish. Stayed in bed till about 10-ish. Got up and showered. 
then I started reviewing again what we were going to go over in lab or going to dissect in lab. And today is going to be fun because we're going into the neck region and we're going to expose this area right here. I got my little morning coffee here. I'm going to drink it, enjoy it, and then I'll see you guys later. So uh, it's Friday night. And I'm going on a date because this week has been hefty, hefty, hefty. I also received my score for my anatomy practical. I was very excited with the way that my first exam turned out because it just showed me that I'm going to be okay. The way that I studied for it was good. Like I worked hard, so my score showed it. And I'm excited. I'm excited to do all these exams because I'm I know I can handle it. But I'm gonna celebrate a success, two successes, and my quizzes as well. They went well. I haven't gotten my histo um, quiz grade back yet, but stats went very well as well. So it's time to have a fun night. Good morning. It's Saturday, and I'm up. Um, I woke up early today so I could <laughs> I woke up early today so that I could get some work done in the morning and I'm on my way to school because they have a club meeting for ACFAS so I'm on my way to school I should be there in 17 minutes right at 9.55 the meeting starts at 10 and it's going till 12 and we are going to be practicing our suturing skills. So I'm excited because I've never done that before. And I'm going to be a surgeon and I've never done that before. But I'm practicing now. I'm getting my hands nice and trained. And then after I have a Bible study at 1. And then after that, it's just study, study, study. Biochem. Woohoo. By the way, um, ACFAS stands for American College of uh, Foot and Ankle Surgeons, and it's a national club that students are able to um, participate in. So out of the many, many, many clubs that my school has to offer, that was one of the ones that I chose to join for now, and I joined one more, which is um, a club that helps you develop your Spanish skills. So I'm a fluent Spanish speaker, but I don't know, like, I guess you could say it's like, not slang Spanish, but it's not like the formal proper Spanish and like those um, like medical terminology, things like doing a foot exam, like those are very um, important things that I need to learn how to do, especially in Spanish. So I felt like that, that club was very beneficial and amazing as well. That ends the vlog. I hope you enjoyed the week-long vlog. Um, I try to get as much clips as I could for you guys. Please let me know if you enjoyed it, if you would like more of that in the comments. Um, if you have any ideas on what you would want to see from me, please feel free to let me know. Feel free to let me know. My next week's video will be pretty exciting too. I already have that planned out. I got that down packed. But um, 
I'm going to Bible study now. Today's Saturday. Um, and that's the end of the week for me. A lot of cool things happened this week. It was very exciting. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch you next time.